Hi everyone and welcome to this quick tutorial about solving an arithmetic sequence word problem. So let's get started. So it says Josh decides to complete uh, to compete in a marathon. Whoops, in marathon. In a marathon and begins to train for it. On the first day he visits the gym and trains for one hour. If he increases his training time by 30 minutes each day, how long will he train for at the end of two weeks? So we have some important information here. It says on the first day, right? When we see that, we automatically know that it's going to give us our use of one. So on the first day, he visits the gym and trains for one hour. So that immediately tells me my use of one is one because it's one hour. If he increases his training time by 30 minutes each day, so each day that tells me he's going to gym, he's going to the gym every day. It's not telling me he goes every other day, it says 30 minutes each day. So that implies that he's going every day. Okay, and if he increases his training time by 30 minutes each day, that's a constant increase. The first day, so the second day would be one plus now 30 minutes, I can't just write 30, I have to be very careful here. This one is in terms of hours, and 30 is in, term, is in terms of minutes. So I have to convert both of them to a similar value. So hours gives me a whole number, so I'm going to go with that. 30 minutes is half of an hour, so it's going to be 0.5. So that's how much you would train on the second day. On the third day, he would train for this same value and increase it by half an hour again. So this increase is constant, so it is an arithmetic circle. Okay, so we have this information and it says, how long will he train for at the end of two weeks? At the end of two weeks. So two weeks is 14 days, right? So it's asking me on the 14th day, how long is he going to train for? So what I'm trying to find is u sub 14. Now let's go back and refresh our memory about the about the formula. It's u sub n equals u sub 1 plus n minus 1 times d. Right? So I have u sub 14 equals u sub 1. My u sub 1, first day, 1 hour, so 1. Plus my common difference d is going to be 0.5 because that's what he increases his uh, gym time by each day. And my n is 14, so 14 minus 1 is going to give me 13. So u sub 14 equals 1 plus half of uh, 13 is 6.5. So u sub 14 is 7.5. This means that on the 14th day after Josh starts his training, he's going to train for 7.5 hours. <laughs> wow, that's a lot. Okay, so this is how you deal with word problems. Hopefully that helped. Thank you and see you in the next video.